Hey, what is going on guys? My name is and welcome back to another GTA 5 online video. So in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys a brand new solo unlimited money glitch after patch 1.13. So guys, if you do go on to enjoy this video, please drop a like, it'd be much appreciated. And on that, let's move on with the video. So to start this all off, you're going to need to purchase the mule. The mule is a vehicle of the Warstock website. Um... It's around about 20 grand, so you want to purchase the mule and park it near your garage door. So, after you've done this, you're going to, you know, pull out any gun. You're going to shoot all four of the tires. Uh, shoot all of them. Last time, you only had to do uh, two of the tires, the money glitch. You only had to do two tires, but now you have to shoot all four. So, once you've done this, you want to head inside of your garage on foot, just like normal. And as you see here, the mule isn't parked right against the garage door. It's kind of like a few meters back. Um... And once you've done that, head inside of your garage, as I said. Now, once you're inside of your garage, you need to pick out any motorbike. Um, I'm going to be using my Batty 801. Unfortunately, it is destroyed, so I'm going to have to call Mules Mutual. But, um, yeah, once you've got your motorbike, you want to just head onto it. And then you want to accelerate and head outside of your garage. So guys, once you are driving out of your garage, make sure you don't press anything on your controller. You know, you just want to leave it um, to do its thing. And basically what's going to happen is it's going to ram against the mule. And then you're going to reverse, it's going to go uh, ram back. And then you should be, uh, you know, underneath the mule. It should like glitch out and fling you underneath the mule. And once it does this, uh, I had to get back in the mule because sometimes it will kind of uh, block it so you can't get onto it. But uh, as you see right here, I now have a duplicated version on my map. There's actually two motorbikes now, and but uh, but what you want to do is get uh, onto the one without a tracker, and you want to leave the one with a tracker where it is. So just to show you guys properly, I'm going to ride over. That's the one with the tracker right there. But you're going to drive this one down to the Los Santos Customs. So guys, once you're at the Los Santos Customs, all you need to do is pull up your phone, go to the internet. You're going to go to the Southern San Andreas SuperAutos.com website, and you're going to go and purchase the Karen Rebel for three grand. So uh, you want to purchase that choose the uh, apartment where you at uh, where the bike came from as well I'm going to replace it with you know the rapid GT and once I've purchased the Karen rebel guys all you want to do is uh, call up you know your mechanic so you can actually you know request for the rebel so you want to phone up your mechanic drive into the Los Santos customs as fast as you can uh, right to the back choose your rebel press right on the d-pad go down to sell and uh, you can now sell your vehicle but guys just before you sell it you want to wait for the orange spinning little marker as always so i see right here i'm just going to wait for that orange little spinning marker now this vehicle doesn't actually sell for that much money um but guys i'm going to be posting a video today on how to sell your motorbikes for over 700k so definitely watch out for that video but anyway guys once you have sold it and all that you want to go back up to your garage and uh, just repeat the process over and over again so guys if you have enjoyed this video please drop a like very much appreciated if you're new around my channel don't forget to subscribe for more awesome gta 5 content and I'll see you guys on my next video.